Hey guys, this is Jared from the Imploded Cacti Squad. Uh, today, I'm just going to be doing a little Let's Play in uh, Far Cry Primal. Uh, I'm going to start out here by uh, doing one of these side quests. I'm going to go do that one down there. I think it's, uh, what is it called? Let's see. Uh, Tribal Clash. Where I'm going to be burning down a camp. I'm gonna show you guys where it's at. It's right there. On the bottom part of the map in the swampy area, kinda. Alright. Let's get started with that. I really like this game. But, uh, in some ways, I don't like it as much as Far Cry 4. Because in Far Cry 4. It was a lot more fun to, uh, you know, just like use, uh, flamethrowers and stuff, but I would certainly appreciate this game. Ooh, look at that. That's pretty cool. Alright. So, I'm kind of confused about what I'm supposed to do here. Is there like a... I'm guessing I'm supposed to go there. Well, I'm just going to go over there and just get started. If it's not the right thing, it's fine. I'll just do this. Wasn't really <coughs> wasn't really looking to do anything specific. Oh dang, is that a black panther or is that a regular? I should probably use it, get that as a friend if it's a I d I've never seen one of those before. Maybe it's just a regular panther, it's just the lighting's weird, but I'm pretty sure it's a Yeah, it's a rare black jaguar. That's really interesting actually. I'm actually really interested to see uh, see that because I've never actually seen one of those before. So I'm guessing I'm supposed to free these guys here. That was really easy, so I'm pretty sure that wasn't the actual quest. But all right, I'm gonna continue here. Let's see what else there is to do. I'm gonna go talk to, uh, this is the main quest, I'm gonna go talk to Erky. Um, so I guess if you don't want any spoilers, this isn't the video for you. Wait. Oh, I'm guessing because I'm in combat, it's not gonna let me fast travel, but it's alright, I'll just get out of here. God, why are there so many of these rhinos? It's really weird. Yeah, this is really bizarre. I'm just gonna... God, this guy is relentless. Come on. There we go. Alright, so now it's probably going to let me fast travel here. So yeah, possibly minor spoilers. Ooh, it's dark. So, since it is in fact dark, I think I'm going to just wait until the day here. It's a pretty nice waterfall. I've actually been up there. The view from up there is crazy. I'm actually going to show you guys that later. Uh, if, if we get time. First I'm going to do this quest. Go talk to Erky the Thinker. 
I've actually done a quest for this guy before, and I'll tell you, he's uh, not much of a thinker at all. He's actually uh, uh, what some might call uh, an idiot. So let's watch this cutscene here, and you'll see what I'm talking about. Urki. Ash Urki Udam Pash. Urki Udam Amalsha. Udam Urki Karsa. Looks like he's in trouble. So yeah, this guy's like your stereotypical redneck, uh, despite this being 10,000 BC. So I have to go find him some special rocks. I guess he's going to try to make some uh, armor or something like that. I'm guessing something will happen, though. Can't just be that. Maybe I'll run into a group of um, Udam or uh, the other tribe trying to protect their special rocks or something like that. Or maybe, yeah, see, it's like in this little village here. I'm going to try to take out this village stealthily before I look for the rocks. Just because it'll be cool. <laughs> A pretty nice village, honestly. Alright. I'm gonna start here. Wait, first of all, I want to check if there's any. Doesn't appear that there's any uh, alarms of any sort, so this shouldn't be too difficult. Here we go. Alright, he's out. They're on to me. But it's alright. I can get him. Alright, that's two. I have no clue what that. I don't even know what's going on over there. Something happened there. All right, so I'm gonna get on my way here. Try to take this guy down real quick. Watch this, guys. Oh, oh shit! They're on to me. It's all right. I can take them out. I'm sure. Look at that. Oh, and look, they did have an alarm. This is just great. And look at that epic takedown right there. I think I should be able to do this, though, pretty easily. I was going to try to be stealthy about it, but I guess that's not going to happen. Is that everybody? Either way, I'm going to start looking for rocks now. They should, like, glow, right? What's this? There's a rock. Need to find two more. While either trying to avoid or taking out these enemies here. I'm just going to take them out. It'll be pretty simple. Look at that. see here look for some more rocks there's one go real quick take it all right 
this little alligator in the water. I've actually been using uh, eagle vision or whatever they call it in this game a lot more than in uh, other Far Cry games and even other like Assassin's Creeds and like all those games that have this kind of thing. I think I've actually used it the most in this game. Just wave after wave of enemy, but they're not even intimidating. Oh, maybe they are intimidating. Crap. Maybe I shouldn't have talked. Lots of fire in this game, too. I guess when there's no uh, guns or explosives, fire's all you got. Yeah, that guy right there. We we'll try to take him out with one arrow. Here we go. And fire. And of course, I missed. See, like, look at this. Look how much like shit really burns in this game. More than any other game. I'm guessing the last rock might be over here. Yep. Figured. But before that guy can get to me, I'll just grab this rock and just get out of here. Alright, now I gotta bring those rocks back to him real quick and then see what happens. Let's just grapple up here and get going. I'm guessing, judging by what happened at the end of the last mission, that something really stupid is going to happen. He's just going to act even more like an idiot. Because Erky is not the brightest. But yeah, I actually do enjoy this game. It's beautiful. Except the uh, the graphics, like the further away areas, look pretty basic, but it looks nice enough. Little monkeys. Here we go. Oh god. This is gonna be bad. Goodbye, Erky. Oh my, that's actually pretty shocking. I just killed Erky, that's terrible. Alright. You'll have a proper burial. I'm so confused because he's making sounds like he's alive, but he certainly isn't. So I'll just get out of here and I'm gonna go up there and show you guys uh, the view from that waterfall up there, and then I think that'll conclude this let's play. Gotta find a way up there. Beautiful. I'm guessing that there's just kind of be like a little ridge. No clue what that is. Or actually, I think I do know what that is. That it's actually a thing that shows there's like a collectible or something by the uh, by the waterfall. I think I've actually already gotten that. Now if I go around this ridge here, I think I might be able to follow it all the way back to the waterfall. Possibly. It's 
a gorgeous waterfall though. The waterfall itself kind of reminds me of uh, I don't know if you've ever seen the uh, waterfall from the Pixar movie um, Up. Kind of looks like that in a way. But yeah, the view from the top is equally as uh, impressive. Just because how far you can see. It's mostly in, usually in this game your view is shrouded like by uh, trees and rocks and things, but when you're up here really bizarre because you can see for a really long time a really long ways I guess not time <laughs> all right but yeah looky here it's just like a it's a gorgeous view of this whole area that is an outpost down there it's like the swamp outpost I'm gonna show you on the map real quick where it is there that is the hardest outpost to get in the whole world like it's ridiculous i tried for like three hours one day and i just kept dying every time because every time i thought i took out the final alarm or whatever and there was always another one somewhere it just really annoyed me another cool thing about this waterfall because kind of boring up here but another cool thing about it is of course since it's a waterfall you can just jump off and do a beautiful dive into the water and uh what a way to end this let's play I think I'm going to end this. This was Jared from uh, the Cacti, the Imploded Cacti Squad uh, with you guys. Um, leave a comment if you'd like me to continue this series. Uh, make sure you subscribe for more action, games, uh, comedy, and gaming news from the Imploded Cacti Squad. Thank you very much. See ya.